Hi, Doyun. Hello. Can you hear me well? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, how about... Can you see me? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Yes, okay, great. Good evening, and Welcome back here. How are you today, Doyun? Hmm. Uh, I'm so, so. Your? Hmm, I'm not. You're not good? Hmm, I'm good. You're good. Oh, did you go to school? Hmm, yeah. Uh huh, what did you do? Hmm, I study. Study what? Uh, study. Study what? Study. Study. Okay, how about... Hmm... How's the weather there today? Oh, good. You're, oh, it's good. It's a good weather today. It's, is it hot? No. Oh, no, it's good to know. Okay, how about... Did you already eat your dinner? Dinner? Yeah. Mm, yes. What did you eat for dinner? Uh, meat. Meat. Yes. Oh, okay. Anyway, hmm, you did not do something fun today? Mm, nothing. Nothing fun, not fun, not really fun, just a normal day? Yes. Yes, okay, anyway, let's have our lesson. Are you not ready? Yes? No. Not ready? Not ready. Why? Oh, I don't want to study. Why? What do you want to do then? Mm, playing. Play what? Playing game. What game? Um, computer game. Wow. <laughs> oh, I thought you want to play like, uh, like Simon Says. Oh. No? You don't want that? Mm, well, better than this. Better than this? Mm. <laughs> oh, I see. You don't want to have a lesson. Ouch. <laughs> oh, my God. Uh-huh. Oh, what should we do? Mm -hmm. What should we do then? Should mm. I start sharing my screen now? Maybe. Maybe. Uh-huh. Mm. Okay. Okay, then. So, let's... Uh, last time, we did not finish our lesson. So, I think mm. we should um, continue this one. So, sh do you want to answer it first or you want to read again? Since it was... The lesson was last week. So, I don't think you can still remember. It's about... Music. Hmm. Do you want to read first? Well, uh, read what? Read the story again. No. Ah, uh, no. You sure? So you're mm. confident that you can answer this one. Okay. So let's answer this. Uh huh. So are the following statements true or false according to the reading passage, or if it is information not given? So it might be hmm. true, false, or not given. Are you sure you don't want to read? In the Northwestern News University study, the non-musicians could hear better. No. no. No, it's false. Yeah. Okay. False or not given? No, false. Okay, so Nina Cross can play the violin very well. Mm-hmm. Let's see, Nina. Nina Cross. Can she play the violin very well? What do you think? Mm, not given. Not given. Yeah, it's not given. Okay, next. People who speak well can learn to play an instrument quickly. Who speak well. Mm hmm People who speak well can learn to play an instrument quickly. Mm. 
no, not given. Not given. Okay, next. Uh, got bread clock is an uh, got bread clock is an HRI music health drug patient. He's not sure. Is that true? Is that false? Or not it's true. not given? False. It's false, yeah, because he studied this one. And studies show that listening to music helps people sleep better. Is that true or false? Yes, true. Yes, it's true. But is it true for you? No. No. Ah. <laughs> no, sometimes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Helena Cross believes that singing lessons can help students get better grades in school. What do you think? Is mm -hmm. it true? Is it false or not given? She believes that singing lessons can help students can uh, get better grades in school. Yes. That is true. Very oh. Why did mm -hmm. I circle false? Okay. So this one. And so let's have this one. Okay, identify supporting reasons. Okay. So reasons are a type of supporting detail. A text may contain one or more reasons why something happens. And identifying why things happen helps you better understand the relationship between things in the text. So, here, the reason may appear before or after the action or effect. So, we have sentences here. And mm -hmm. words or phrases that signal reasons include because of, like this, since, and due to. Because of, yeah, yeah, yeah. And the following examples. Okay. So okay. here. Hmm. Musicians hear better because this is like, um, this is like the effect. The underlying words are the effect of something. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because they learn to pay attention to certain words, uh, sounds. Singing words may help stroke patients since. Oh, yeah, that one. Okay, so we have to read the passage so we can answer the letter B. But we have to identify the phrases or words that signal reasons, like because, since, due to. Okay? Mm -hmm. Can you please read first? And then let's circle the words or phrases that signal reasons, like because, since, due to. Mm -hmm. Because, since, due to. Yeah. Please read. Okay, read the passage below. Circle the words or phrases that signal reasons. How was how has Western music reached almost every corner of the world? Researchers believe Western music is popular because of its ability to express emotions across culture. Uh, do we have uh, do we mm -hmm. have a signal reason signal word for reasoning here? Mm, yes. Yeah, where? For a second uh, yeah. or second sentence? Because. Because. Okay. Next. Researcher Tom Fritz. Researcher Tom Fritz played parts of for the two Western songs to members of the Mafa, an ethnic group in Cameroon. Since he wanted to include a variety of Western music types, Fritz played classical rock, pop, and zen. He asked the group members to point the pictures of the pictures of people's face to show the emotion the music express. Okay. The, hmm. So we have word, a word, signal word there. Maybe. Maybe. Since. since. Okay, since you wanted to include. Do so we have more? Where? Do we have do we have more to this paragraph? Hmm? Or do we have I don't know. I think none, no other hmm. than since. Okay, next. Yeah, you can see too, right? Mm -hmm. 
Okay, next third paragraph. Okay, the Mafa were able to identify the emotions correctly. This was probably due to due to the fact that the rhythms and melodies of Western music are similar to those of basic human speech. So some part of the way we understand Western music is shared by everyone, regardless of our own cultures. Okay. So, do we have a signal word here? Signal due to. Due to. Do we have more? No. Oh, no. Very mm -hmm. good. So, answer these questions with supporting reasons from the passage. Okay, why do researchers believe Western music is popular? Oh, why do researchers I... believe? Western music is popular because its ability to express emotions across cultures. Okay, because of its ability yes. to express what? Emotions. Yeah. Across cultures. Okay, next question. Why did Tom Fritz play classical rock, rock, pop, and jazz music? Why? Hmm. I I wonder why. <laughs> you wonder why? Yes. Oh, it's in the passage too. Mm hmm. What's the reason? Why? Why did Tom Fritz play classical um, rock, pop, and jazz music? That's, that's why. I don't know. That's because he wanted to include a variety of Western music. Yeah, type. he wanted to include a variety of Western music types. Okay, next. Why were the Mafa able to identify the emotions correctly? Mm -hmm. Why? Oh, that's a difficult question. That's a difficult question? Yeah. Yeah. Hmm? It's a difficult yeah. question. The answer is on this the passage hmm. too. Maybe due to the fact that the rhythms and melodies of Western music are similar to those of basic human speech. Yeah, that's the answer. Due yes. to the fact that the rhythms blah 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 blah. We know that. Okay. So, does listening to music help you study or concentrate? No. No. Why? It's a... B. Distraction. Right? For yes. you. So, if so, what kinds of music help you? Or mm. what do you do to concentrate when you study, when you don't listen to music? Mm. What helps you to mm. concentrate more? What helps you study? Uh, eating something. Oh, eating something while you're doing. Yeah. Uh, okay. So I. Hmm? You will say I eat something. <laughs> to okay. concentrate. Concentrate better. On something. On or in. Mm -hmm. Study. So, okay. How about this? Complete each sentence with the correct answer. It must be or it can be A or B. Okay, words in context. We have first, if you ignore something, you blank it. If you ignore something, you blank it. What is it? Is it A or B? 
Uh, don't pay attention to. A. Don't pay attention to it. Okay, next. Yeah. Certain sound refers to blank type of sound. Certain sound. What type of sound is that? Is that only um, one or any? Any. Yeah, it's any. Okay, so if you concentrate, you blank. What do you do when you concentrate? Uh... Think about, think very hard. Yeah, think very hard. Okay, two examples of skills are? Mm. What are the two examples of skills we have? Is it food and drink? Uh, cooking and sewing. Of course, maybe. cooking and sewing. Do you know how to cook? No. Oh, no. Do you want to learn mm. how to cook? Uh, yes, I think. Yeah, definitely. Mm. Okay, next. A person's overall abilities means their abilities. Mm. What? Related to a single skill or as a whole? Overall. As a whole. As a whole. Very good. Okay, now complete the paragraph with the words from the box. Do we have? Yeah, let's. Last part. Okay. In his book, please read and let's answer. Oh, in his book, Music Opia. Brain scientist Dr. Oliver Stock. Look, look at the connection between the music and the brain. Mm -hmm. Connection. Mm -hmm. And then he, he wrote, wrote about, about how music damaged the eyes of musicians. Damaged? No. <laughs> what? Improved. Improved. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Improved. Okay. Hospital patients and ordinary people. Next. Um. Doctor. Doctor. Uh, also shared the experiences of different people. He gave an example of a man whose brain was. His brain was. Um, a star. Uh huh. Star. Oh. Yes. Hmm? Sharp by a lightning strike. Damage. No. Yeah, it's damaged. Mm. Oh, okay. Which? Were strangely left and wishing to become a musician at age 42. Mm -hmm. Another interesting example was a, a man whose memory, sharp, no, normally lasted only yeah. seven seconds. Except Ooh. when he listened to music. Oh. When this happened, his mind became very sharp with a near perfect memory. Yeah, okay. Well, music helps you, you know, to memorize quickly because you have the notes and all you have the beat to memorize just so you can produce a good music. That's it. Okay, so we can add ION at the last part of a word or a suffix to some words oh. to form nouns. Okay, so read oh. the sentences below using the verbs in the box. 
So these words are verbs, but when you put ion at the end or the suffix, it will become noun. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay, please. Then we... Still have a lot to learn about the connection between language and music. Yeah. Connection between language and music. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then the new. The new Taylor Swift song has received mixed. Uh, mixed. Reaction? Yeah, reactions. Do you know where? Reaction. Oh, do you know Taylor Swift? No. You don't know her, really? Yes. He's like most famous artist. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah, you don't know her, really? Taylor Swift. This, I bet you know her, but maybe you've seen her somewhere or you've heard her songs. You just didn't know that it's her. Like, mm -hmm. love. Uh, uh, awesome. He has a lot of songs. Yeah. Romeo, take me somewhere we can be alone. I don't know if you know that. Or... Mm. No, hmm. she has a lot of songs. She's very famous. In mm. I can't believe you don't know her. <laughs> yeah, it just proves that you don't really listen to music, don't you? Okay, where are we? Where are we? Here. Okay. And last, the issue of music education in schools is a major topic of what? Discussion? Yeah, discussion. Mm. Okay, so when you go to school, what do you discuss, usually discuss? You have your phone, right? I have my phone, yes. And then you have social media? Yes. What social media do you have? Like Instagram or Cacao Talk only? Mm, two. You have Instagram too? Yeah, yes. Other than Instagram, do you have any more? Yes. Like YouTube? No, not YouTube. You don't, you don't watch in YouTube? I watch YouTube, but I have... Yes. Yeah, how about... You don't know Facebook. WhatsApp. Or Snapchat. Mm -hmm. Don't have those kind of apps? No, oh, like that. Like that. What? One more time? Mm, yes, I have. Oh, you have? But you don't... You haven't seen, like, an Instagram. How about TikTok? Do you have TikTok? No. No. Okay, so you haven't really heard of Taylor Swift, even in Instagram? Maybe you know when mm -hmm. you listen to her music, maybe you, you know some of her songs, but you just really don't know that it's her. Maybe that's the case. Mm -hmm. It's in very impossible to, you know, not know about her. Okay, anyway, so... Let's just uh, continue this tomorrow. Will it be tomorrow? Do we have class tomorrow? I think we do. We, uh, yeah. nine, nine, eight? Yes. It's eight tomorrow. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know, nine on your time. What, uh, eight? On your time, time. Eight. Yeah, on my time, it's 8 p.m. Okay. So, hmm, what did we talk about? We talked about songs. Songs like music. Uh, music. Taylor Swift. Like Taylor Swift. Taylor Swift. Yeah. <laughs> you just remember her. <laughs> hmm. We just talked about her mainly. We have uh music and brain. 
and brain. Yeah, and uh, uh, the effects of music to to some other people, right? Yeah. Right. Uh, and it can help. What what are the things music can help to you? To other uh, people? Yeah, there are things. Hmm? What does music do to you or to other people? Does it make you feel better or what? What does uh, it affect? Uh, improves memory. Memory. Very good. Okay, so the, what else improves memory? How about the feeling when you're stressed? Do you think it will help? Music will help you? Mm, maybe. But in your case, is not it? So. Mm -hmm. <laughs> not so. Okay, now I wonder. So you just said that you, you eat something when you want to concentrate on your in your studying, right? Mm -hmm. How about other hobbies that you have? Painting? Do you paint? No. Oh, you painting. just play games. Hmm? You just play games, right? Yes. Okay, okay. So anyway, do you have any more questions? Not any questions. No more questions? Okay, and if you have no more questions, I think it is time to say goodbye to you now. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, bye-bye. Mm -hmm. Bye. -bye. bye, -bye.